Great question. So I think CDNs have always been there, um, you know, to deliver performance and actually make the internet usable for uh, for broadband and even you know in the early times dial up. But a lot has changed in the last five years. Uh, for example, um, let's talk about traffic. Uh, it took Akamai about ten years to reach a terabit of capacity in traffic. Uh, this September, uh, uh, within the last five years, this September, we, we delivered 13 terabits of traffic. So that, that's all one terabit to 13 terabit in the last five years. So, so traffic has, uh, has exploded in the era of hyperconnectivity. So that's one. Uh, the other is the complexity, the level of complexity that's, that's going on. It used to be uh, used to access the internet from home and work. Uh, now you're seeing an explosion of mobile devices. Uh, a user expects to access multiple services services, multiple types of content on any device over any network at any time. So that adds a degree of complexity to a enterprise and business user uh, that's, that's you know, trying to uh, you know, satisfy their needs. So the ability to simplify the internet is something that the internet, uh, uh, that a CDN does um, by its ability to uh, deliver uh, a single stream uh, and also to be able to adapt the content to whatever the device happens to be. So the simplicity uh, is something that the, the CDN brings. Um, and then as it relates to uh, you know, how, how it affects a, a network operator, um, you know, it used to be that a, a enterprise would perhaps buy a hosting service from a network operator and basic connectivity for a network operator. And, and now there's a plethora of cloud services that are available. They're, uh, again, trying to reach multiple different devices. And a CDN helps simplify all of that so, so that they can uh, you know, simplify their infrastructure, they can reduce their costs, and they can, they can you know, outsource more of their platform. Uh, three ways. You know, the, the, the first is is by uh, traffic offload and acceleration. So, um, you know, Akamai has a number of uh, premium content, you know, global content relationships and a, and a lot of traffic that we bring to the table. So we allow the network operator to offload that traffic, accelerate the delivery so their subscribers benefit. Uh, the second way would be through uh, embedding technology into their network. Um, and, and, and what that does is it allows them to enable new services. So a lot of service providers have licensed content relationships. They now need to reach multi-screens. CDN is a perfect way to do that and to increase revenue uh, and reduce churn of the subscriber base. And then the third way is to, to sell advanced services um, to enterprises. So when you look at what they're trying to accomplish and differentiate their connectivity uh, and their cloud infrastructure via other uh, other service providers, CDN is a perfect way to do that. It allows them to uh, not only differentiate but sell advanced services to to enterprises who are you know increasingly trying to reach a global audience.